On Monday, one of my homegirls told me that her daughter was having her Kent Sienna, and she was like, Josh, you got to come to the Kent Sienna, and you got to perform for my daughter. And I was like, nah, I ain't going to no Kent Sienna. And she was like, why you can't go to the Kent Sienna? It's for my child. I said, because I've been to a Kent Sienna, and I don't know if I can afford to go to another Kent Sienna. Five things you probably want to know if you've never been to a Kent Sienna. Cinco. Number one. Kinsietas will cost more than royal weddings. Now, I don't know where the savings account is at. I don't know when the tradition started. All I know is when that child have her Kinsieta, the parents spare no expenses. They fly planes. They will take an entire ocean. Like if they on the West Coast, they will take the ocean from the East Coast and they will get that move to the West Coast just for that day. They gonna be horses. They gonna be carriages. They gonna be music. They gonna go get saludo, saludo, and Tocable, whatever the band name is, whatever that child wants on that Kinsietta, that child will get. They will go for broke every single Kinsietta. Number two, they are going to rent out the biggest, most expensive area they can find. If you think you finna show up to the back of somebody's house, a little small yard with a little tile on the floor with some ribs being thrown on the grill, nah, you are wrong. If the cathedral could be brought to their house, if they can get that flown in from an airplane privately, they gonna fly the cathedral in. People donate money. The entire family, all 500,000 people, they gonna throw in $10,000 for this one birthday. You can put 18 kids in college, but this 15-year-old is finna rent out the Taj Mahal in Dubai for her kids to I can't go to the store and get a $40 pair of Reebok Classics, man. I want to be a 15-year-old Mexican girl, man. Just for one year. For one year. Number three. At least 55 men will tell you they're going to kill for their niece. I ain't even know she had 55 uncles. I don't know where all these primos and these tios and these papas and these grandpapas show up from, but I'm telling you, every single man you, hey, what's up, I'm Josh Brady, nice to meet you. Yeah, dog, that's my, that's my niece and I killed for her. Okay, homie, hey, man, what's up, my name is Josh Brady, well, hey, my name is Ricardo, but I'll, it's my cousin, I'll kill for her. Hey, mister, you know what I'm saying, you like, you about a hundred, you ain't gonna kill nobody, how you doing? I'll kill you for her, I'll kill you. Little Maria's Kinsietta party. She ain't got to worry about nobody playing with her, messing with her, bothering her, because she got 101 Dow Latino men in here that'll take your life twice if you even try to get loud with her. Number four, her papa is going to crown the inside and say, that's my little girl, about 15 times when it has nothing to do with nothing. Now me, I'm a birthday person. I like to give the best birthday present. I like to see the parents say, hey man, shout out to your child, man, it's their birthday, celebrate their birthday. Yay, yay. When you go to a Kinsietta, be prepared for that daddy to say, thank you, Josh, but that's my little girl. Okay, okay, but we won't even talk about that. We'll talk about football. Yeah, the Dolphins are good, but that's, that's still my little girl. Yeah, I understand, Jose. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. She can always be a little girl, bro. Hey, so um, I need a job. Yo, your boss hiring? Oh, he hiring, but... That's my little girl right there. Jose, she ain't even in the party yet, Jose. Who you keep saying that's your little girl? You got more kids than your daughter in here? Is that your child too, Jose? Whoa, oh, Josh, calm down, Josh. You don't understand. If you had a daughter, you would be understand. <laughs> That's my little girl. <laughs> and number five, after they're done celebrating a million dollar birthday for their 15 year old, it turns into an adult party. Go home once that cake and a happy birthday is said. Go home because once they done celebrating her, it turns into an all out pop the Coronas, turn that music up. This is my niece, but y'all better go sit in that corner because we came here to party. I ain't come here to be here all day. The Kinsietta was on a Saturday. It's Tuesday morning and we still here. That child went gown, Kinsietta, gown, prom, dress, whatever you call it for the 50 year old. That thing don't change color four times. I want to go on. You got seventh, eighth, and ninth graders in here. My kids ain't even eat yet. I do not want to. <sighs> Mexicans take Kinsiettas like presidential inaugurations. Mexicans treat Kinsiettas like black people treat baptisms when a first thug in the hood get baptized. Mexicans treat Kinsiettas like white folks treat every single holiday. 
If you're not prepared, if you've never been to a quinceañera, please look at this video as 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 a as a resource, cause I'm so tired.